Gal Gilboa was at the Nova Music Festival in Israel on October 7th. He survived by hiding in the woods for eight hours before finally being rescued. But his little brother Guy was captured by Hamas. This is the selfie he took when I arrived to the festival and sent to our mother. It was 15 minutes before the siren started. Guy Gilboa can be seen in these images released by Hamas, one of the first videos to show hostages. You know, it's been over five weeks and we haven't heard anything. We don't have any sign of life. We don't know how they treat him. You don't, we don't know in what condition he's kept. Um, and yeah, that's just uh, hard. Every day that go by, it's like eternity. And I can't stop thinking about him. I wish it was October 6th again. And I have to trust my government and I have to trust the USA government and I have to trust the international pressure will help bring them back. Um, because that's all I can, that's all I have. Every day, thousands of people like Gal are hoping for the return of their loved ones. I wake up each morning to remember this truth. My family is being held hostage by terrorists. Jewish New Yorker Alana has six members of her family being held by Hamas, including a three- and four-year-old. My aunt is missing 60% of her family, of her core family of 10. She only now has four around her, her, her Shabbat table. We are in just desperation, desperation for them to return to us. Around 240 hostages are believed to be being held in Gaza, including nine Americans. Active negotiations for their release are currently underway between the US, Israel, Egypt and Qatar.